The Zago Fair is a large complex of pavilions south of the River Sava. Since the 1950s, it has been used for countless fairs and exhibitions. In February, there are three fairs at the same time. The flashiest one is definitely the boat show Nautica. To use all this, you don't need to go any further than the Croatian coast. Along this beautiful coast dotted with 1,200 islands, there are more than 50 marinas for yachts and motorboats. Various producers display their sailing boats, motorboats, scooters, kayaks, boat engines, sea apparel, fishing and diving equipment. As a rule, the most expensive boats are sold first. Next to these monsters, you could easily miss a cute little fair organised by the high schools of Zagreb. Under the auspices of the Zagreb Tourist Board, it promotes the culture of tourism. We are presenting the project Moinaklon for the culture of tourism for the Zagreb Tourist Board. We have prepared four topics, city clocks, the hat and the tie, the wells and the pumps street organs and street musicians. Ties are related to our Cravat Regiment, which walks the city streets every Saturday and Sunday from June to September for the ceremony of changing the guard. Nikola Tesla High School is celebrating its 130th anniversary. We have come to show Tesla's transformer and his rotating magnetic field. They were helped by the Technical Museum, which has weekly scientific presentations of Tesla's work. Tesla could be a great promoter of tourism in Zagreb. He created a lot of inventions in his lifetime. One of their projects is what they call electrical works. You take a piece of plexiglass and use machines to cut a shape like Tesla here. Below it, you place an ordinary 9 volt battery with LED. That's it. The School of Geodesy is also here, but everyone needs a break from science. Finally, there is the Fair of Gastronomy. This wine producer comes from Krasic, the birthplace of Blessed Cardinal Stepinac. We've been producing wines for many years. Our winemaking tradition goes back to my father's great-grandfather. The county of Varaždin is showing its traditional dishes. Last year, I won the first place at the Crow Top 10 competition here. Now he's preparing the Varajdin bread, which has been eaten by Varajdin families for centuries. As the winner, he will represent Croatia at the Global Chef Challenge in Milan in October. The citizens of Varajdin are well known for the variety of their flour, like buckwheat, rye, corn or wheat, and that's why they make Varajdin bread. As soon as it's baked, it's gone.